In this second example of the type 2 electrolytic cell, we dissolve copper 2 chloride in water, and we, when the switch is closed, you'll see that the chloride ions, being negative, are attracted to the positive electrode, which is the anode, and the positive copper ion is attracted to the negative electrode, which is the cathode. Chloride ion is oxidized at the anode to make diatomic chlorine, Cl2. The electrons travel up through the wire, being forced to do so by the DC power supply. Keep in mind, this is a non-spontaneous reaction. And the electrons travel to the cathode, where they reduce a copper 2 plus ion to a copper atom. You may wonder why the copper and the chloride are involved in this reaction, whereas water was involved in the previous animation. Again, go to your standard reduction potential table, point to all species present in all locations, and the species which will be reduced will be the highest one on the left. In this example, that turns out to be copper 2 plus, and the species oxidized will be the one that is lowest on the right, and in this example, that is chloride ion.